Frequent use of products containing sulfates contribute to cell damage, hormone imbalances, and excess stripping away of natural oils, and excess stripping away of hair protein. Hey there, it's Annette here. When you see a label that says sulfate free, do you wonder if there's something wrong with the sulfates as an ingredient? If you answered yes, then you're right. Using sulfates in your shampoo is like using laundry detergent in your hair. Shampoo is like magic. How quickly it turns into foam when mixed with water. This is truly a sensual experience. Icky though, the reason for that, and for many supermarket shampoos, is the inclusion of chemical foaming agents like sodium lauryl sulfate and sodium laureth sulfate. Sulfates are a category of chemicals. They are the salts of sulfuric acid, which act as detergents. The most popular ones in personal care products being sodium laureate sulfate and sodium laurel sulfate. Sulfates are the primary chemical used for lathering and foaming, especially in shampoos, cleansers, body washes, and laundry detergents. Sulfates emulsify oils and grease and leave hair and skin feeling squeaky clean. Havoc alarm for your body though. Similar to PEGs, the manufacturing process for the sulfates results in carcinogens, ethylene dioxide, and 1,4-dioxine as contaminant. Frequent use of products containing sulfates contribute to cell damage, hormone imbalances, and excess stripping away of natural oils, and excess stripping away of hair proteins. This is definitely not a good thing. Fortunately, here's an easy and quick way to reduce your levels of exposure to sulfates switch to all natural products that don't contain any chemical preservatives.